रेडी स्टार्ट आई एम इंडीड वेरी हैप्पी टू हैव दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी टू बी प्रेजेंट एट द इनाग्रल सेरेमनी ऑफ द थर्टी सिक्स एडिशन ऑफ द इंडिया इंटरनेशनल ट्रेड फेयर दिस फेयर कमेंसेस एवरी ईयर ऑन फोर्टीन नवम्बर द बर्थ एनिवर्सरी ऑफ द फर्स्ट प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया पंडित जवाहर लाल नेहरू द आई आई टी एफ इज ए मेगा प्रोजेक्शन ऑफ द न्यू इंडिया दैट इज फास्ट टेकिंग शेप इट फोकेस इज द विजन ऑफ ए ग्लोरियस टूमोरो ए स्पिरिट ऑफ एक्सीलेंस एंड अचीवमेंट एंड अनपेरल्ड इन्वेस्टमेंट अपॉर्चुनिटी थ्रू द प्रिज्म ऑफ द मेक इन इंडिया एंड डिजिटल इंडिया इनिशिएटिव टेकन बाय द प्राइम मिनिस्टर द फेयर सिम्बोलाइज इंडिया कमिटमेंट टूवर्ड्स ब्रिंगिंग द बेनिफिट्स ऑफ इकोनॉमिक रिफॉर्म टू इट्स पीपल फ्रॉम ऑल वाक्स ऑफ लाइफ स्पेशली द अंडर प्रिविलेज आई एम हर्ट एंड टू सी द कंसिडरेबल प्रेजेंस ऑफ फॉरन कंपनीज एट द फेयर आई वुड लाइक टू मेक ए स्पेशल मैंशन ऑफ इंडिया कंटिन्यूड इंडेवर ऑफ एम्पावरिंग एंड ब्रिंगिंग टूगेदर ऑल कंस्ट्रक्टिव फोर्सेज फॉर ए बेटर वर्ल्ड द रिसेंट ब्रिक्स समिट has created a great reservoir of goodwill which is vital for consolidating our economic and cultural linkages and social bonds with countries across the world india has always believed in the stability and growth of our neighboring countries putting people first is the guiding philosophy of our development cooperation partnership focused on an agenda aimed at regional harmony peace and prosperity we look forward to working together in priority areas such as infrastructure development connectivity capacity building education healthcare and the setting up of development projects india is working with like minded countries in multilateral organizations including the united nations to play an enhanced role in diverse fora from the arctic council and the pacific alliance to the un security council where india has made a legitimate claim for a permanent membership apart from economic dimensions i believe that a fair such as iitf provides an excellent opportunity to introspect on challenges integrate minds and prepare strategies for the mammoth task of nation building as india strives to become a manufacturing hub in diverse sectors it needs to increase its energy resources without compromising on the environmental aspects factors such as demography development and urbanization exert tremendous pressure on availability of resources large scale utilization of resources impacts adversely on the environment industry therefore needs to adopt eco friendly measures and technologies for the development of the people as there is a considerable presence of foreign countries along with the indian states and uts in the fair i would like to share with you that a range of reforms being currently undertaken including gst 
shall enable the states and union territories to compete with each other in attracting investment and business opportunities over the medium and long term these reforms shall also hopefully result in job creation thus contributing to the growth impulses of the economy it is a matter of great satisfaction that the ministry of commerce and industry has taken an excellent initiative towards improving the ease of doing business in india with added emphasis on simplification and rationalization of existing rules procedures and processes government's recent initiatives on e-governance have begun to show results in terms of more efficient and effective delivery of public areas services i recall having been associated with itpo and iitf while serving the government in different capacities i am pleased to see it grow into a larger and more inclusive platform now i take this opportunity to welcome the global business community who have converged here to further trade and business relations it is encouraging to note that the iitf this year is seeing the presence of 7000 participants including representation from 24 foreign countries almost all states or union territories apex public sector enterprises and the msme and other participants with around 800 rural artisans and craft persons i am told that the national minorities development and finance corporation is also participating along with 100 artisans in this fair this year i compliment them i compliment itpo for the theme of digital india this year digital technologies e-commerce e enabled and mobile services are major components of e governance and will over time contribute significantly to gdp growth we at the same time also need to make use of our abundant renewable sources to create a society that is self sustaining and mindful of its responsibilities towards the present and future generations i believe that iitf will reinforce indian brands brands that will in the first instance compete and win against the dominant international players in the domestic market before venturing overseas i especially welcome our foreign friends exhibitors delegates and members of the diplomatic corps to this event which is considered a crocosm of india a land of vibrancy culture spirituality and peace i extend my good wishes to all participants from india and overseas especially the partner country the republic of south korea stop